In this era of digital transformation and business resiliency, vast amounts of data are being generated every second. And networking infrastructure is still critical on-premises and in the cloud. However, it is becoming more complex and distributed. Network operation teams must be armed with the right tools to avoid costly downtime, meet business SLAs, and address a scale for geographically distributed data centers, edge locations, and cloud regions, often leading to excessive tool sprawl and multiple configuration points with no correlation between them. In today's uncertain and ever-changing environments, businesses demand agility and flexibility to run whatever it makes make sense. However, IT and networking teams have traditionally configured tasks manually for a specific location, technology, or cloud while operating under a reactive break and fix model. Having a single, smart, and consolidated model to provision, manage, secure, and operate your networks regardless the cloud or location you choose to run your business on has become a critical need. In this series, we will be showing you how to install, run, and configure Nexus Dashboard, which will help you and your organization normalize hybrid cloud operations for your hyper-diverse and hyper-distributed networks. To do this, I asked my friend and colleague Max Alvarado to join me. Welcome, Max. Before we get started with the series, I would like to ask a question. You have been a network admin and cloud architect for a few years already, and what do you think is the biggest challenge network admins still have? Hi, Carlos. Well, as you know, network admins are always the first ones to be blamed when a problem happens until they prove differently. In today's world, organizations have disaggregated tools for network management and monitoring on a per cloud or site basis. This means that the network admin role is under more pressure than ever since people expect us to fix communication problems, but most of the time we don't have visibility everywhere and manual correlation is extremely difficult to perform. I normally think there are as many networking tools and different people dealing with them as snack options in a supermarket. <laughs> exactly. Isolated tool sprawl does not help us fixing things faster nor provisioning networking services consistently. And this is exactly what we addressed with Nexus Dashboard. Right, Carlos. The important part here is that Nexus Dashboard is not another network management tool. Let me explain. Nexus Dashboard is a hybrid cloud network services platform that allows you to consolidate and normalize your operations across different sites and clouds. No matter if you run ACI, NXOS, or third-party networks such as public cloud ones, Nexus Dashboard centralizes the management and provides common services for all of them, as we will see next. Nexus Dashboard can run on-prem, as a physical or virtual appliance, or in the cloud provider of your choice, whether as a cloud VM or instance. From there, you can manage and visualize all your data center and cloud network sites, the versions they are running, and the status on each one of them. You can also automatically interconnect all of them together with a few clicks, normalizing your hybrid cloud operations and providing consistent network and policy configurations for all your sites and clouds. This sounds great, Max, but what does this mean for the network admin? It means that we can run a common networking model across multiple sites and clouds, which reduces operational overhead. Think of network services that are configured once and automatically deployed anywhere, or consistent disaster recovery plans, or even better, faster public cloud migrations by extending the network anywhere and with the same security settings I have already defined on-prem. Right, but it does not stop there. Nexus Dashboard continuously extracts hardware and software telemetry from your sites and clouds. All these chunks of data are then turned into actionable insights, automatically correlating multiple events at once and displaying relevant information for you, such as data paths and detected issues. Whenever available, an auto-remediation option will also be shown, 
so that network issues can be corrected with a single click. The more data you feed into Netshoes dashboard, the smarter it gets. That's why you can also integrate it with other Cisco and third-party services such as Thousand Eyes, VMware, ServiceNow, AppDynamics, and many more. This means no more troubleshooting on a per cloud or per device basis. And not only that, Carlos. Just think about all the finger pointing I will avoid when an issue occurs. All my data center and cloud networking operations are not available under one view. For example, talking about operations, think about firmware updates. I have to perform this every once in a while. For many devices, and as you can imagine, maintenance windows are limited. Understanding what version is the right one for my environment is a hard task. I don't have time to read through endless release notes and box IDs, but I can't afford to put my business at risk either. And that's why we are aggregating all firmware update tasks for all your sites and clouds within Nexus Dashboard. Now, you simply download and select the version you want to use on your sites, and within a few clicks, your firmware is installed in all the corresponding switches. And since we don't want an update to go wrong, we have embedded some great analytics in the process so that you can understand what the impact of such upgrade will be, which anomalies, P certs and field notices you will be clearing, and a post-update analysis to make sure everything came back just the way it was. Simply put, we're making firmware updates smarter and less risky. But you might be wondering, do I need to purchase a separate Nexus dashboard license? And the answer is no. Nexus Dashboard software is free of charge if you have Advantage or Premier subscription licenses on your Nexus switches. For example, if you have an Advantage license today, you are entitled to use Nexus Dashboard software with data center and cloud interconnect capabilities, substituting what you will previously do with multi-site orchestrator or MSO. If you have Premier licenses instead, you will have DC and Cloud Interconnect functionalities plus insights, which refers to the automated correlation and smart analytics functions we previously covered. We will go through all these as we cover them in the series. If you use a perpetual licensing model instead, you can still get Nexus Dashboard through some add-ons options. There may be other services in Nexus Dashboard that may follow additional licensing rules, such as Fabric Automation for NXOS environments, which was previously known as DCNM, or Data Broker, which might be useful for network tapping. Nexus Dashboard scales out based on the size, number of sites, and the operational services used to manage them. With this in mind, it is important to design your environment based on your requirements and there are two great tools that should be your starting point every time. One, Nexus Dashboard Capacity Planning, which will allow you to understand how many nodes a cluster needs based on your fabric size, Nexus Dashboard form factor, and functions needed. And two, Nexus Dashboard Services Compatibility Matrix, which will tell you which services can coexist on the same cluster and any limitations you may need to consider. With Cisco Nexus Dashboard, you get a unified network operations view across all your sites, clouds, and services, delivering unprecedented simplicity, reducing risk, and consolidating multiple operational tools. Let us show you how automation and insights can make a difference in how you manage, monitor, and troubleshoot your hybrid cloud networks, integrating Cisco and third-party solutions from a single pane of glass. Let's move on then and get started with the series.